Each day at Lemoyne College, we strive for greatness, but always through the eyes of goodness. This year's reading at Lemoyne College for Core 100 is James Baldwin's Sonny's Blues. It's a story, it's about 20 pages. It's about a brother who is reading a newspaper and he finds out that his brother has been arrested for drug use. The story's about the divide between brothers, the divide between people who love each other but don't see eye to eye and can't see eye to eye. The narrator, Sonny's brother, doesn't really understand him, doesn't really understand his life choices. The older brother finds out that Sonny wants to be a musician. He's kind of shocked and like most probably parents would be, like, why would you want to do that? I'm a musician, so the way James Baldwin writes is very lyrical. He used a lot of like metaphorical language. He talks about like the feeling of ice melting in your stomach. It's about their struggle. Baldwin calls darkness. My troubles make his real. Like suddenly my own grief makes his grief real. My pain makes his pain seem more real. My favorite part is the last scene because the brother finally kind of understands why Sonny has been going through all the things he's endured. You can finally see his brother for who he is. A man who has his own vision, his own needs, his own struggles, and someone that he can connect to and relate to. Our dreams are what push us to grow and our mistakes are what push us to get better. You just gotta keep doing what you're doing and don't let anything stand in the way of what you want to do.